people of the world, let's get the international greeting out the way first. Hola, aloha, cha, salut, ni hao, namaste, ohayu, yagamasma, zdra, suche, privita, buna, jindabri, siesto, hallo, sincha, yabasio, teresa, walakum, saskaka, marhaban, merhaba, habiri, and shalom. My name is Brunel, for those of you who don't know who I am, thank you for joining me. Um, so, shopping, shopping, shopping. Um, I've been shopping quite a bit, I just haven't filmed it. <laughs> Mm. Yeah, uh, so there's H&M, Zara, and uh, Primark this summer. Um, and as you guys know, Primark is a place to find uh, bargains. Um, now, before anything else, this video you're going to see different lighting and so on. It's because unfortunately trying to film outside, it got too dark. And then uh, I had to film the last couple of items indoors. And so apologies ahead of time. Hopefully you'll still be able to see the um, items and what they look like on i hope um so where well, before maybe before i get started into clothes let's start off with the jewelry first uh, super quick i'm gonna whiz through it uh starting off with here and i'm also playing with the lighting here i've got a um lens uh, kind of uh, lighting uh, neutralizer on which darkens things a little bit um to, in order for you to try and, and see the details so you're starting off with this um uh, chunky sort of chain as you guys know, I forget the net, monkey nails as well. Monkey nails? Monkey. Uh, nasty nails. <laughs> Sorry. Um, yeah, so as you guys know, chains are in right now, everywhere, the chunky chains. There are even bigger or chunkier chains than these, but I do feel very, very light. I mean, it's three pound, for goodness sake, what do you expect? But I thought I'd go in and get something like this. So that's that. Um, next lot, actually, these two are very, very similar but they've got different colors. Um, and these are the uh, hooped um, earrings. I like these because they're quite thick. Um, and on this side, you've got like the gold sanded one and then you've got, the, it says here pink, but you know, it's just a touch of pinky to it, um, or pink to it, so one pound each. Nice. Um, and then the next lot, I went out a little bit. Um, uh, you've got these. Ooh, hoops, 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 hoops. Uh, hopefully the camera will focus on that and as you can see it's got the detail there um, of the pearl um, all along and then you've also got it here as well uh, this one was at three pounds and then the next lot uh, these ones now these earrings are everywhere I mean if you've gone inside Zara you've seen earrings are similar to these now the Zara ones are much bigger and obviously heavier and more costly however so if you just want the kind of the sense of the style without having to spend the money then you can save yourself a bit dosh these are three pounds I think the Zara's one's about 15 pounds um I think um and then uh, finally um I got these and again these are uh, sets of earrings they were free in here the cost is only two pounds they're heart shaped you've got three different types here again let me try and see if the camera can focus there you go nice camera thank you thank you thank you and as you can see um I mean they're quite noisy but three pairs for two pounds I'm not going to complain at the end of the day now handbag Woo. Right, let's see. I'm um, trying to make sure I've got all the handbags here. First off is this one here. Quite big. That's the usual size that I go for. Um, and uh, it was on sale for £5. The usual original price was £12. So if you go into Primark, do go into the sales section at the back. You might, most likely will find something in there um, that you find handy. On the inside, I've got just you've got two small pockets and then there's another one with a zip. Um, but there's plenty of room there for you to put your uh, whatever you want to put in there. Uh, I always have plenty to put in. Um, and I forgot this one because uh, I like the unusual colour. I don't have anything of this colour at all. I don't think. <laughs> um, and then next one is this one. Uh, this looks so plush and so lush. <laughs> Look at this. I love the colour. And again, it's this snake print, which is all over the place at the moment. Um, and I just like the colour. And it looks really, really smart. It's got the chain to go with it. Eight pounds is the price for this. And uh, I, I think it's money well worth spent. Um, spent well on the inside. Anyway. I, I don't know what I'm saying. I, I'm hungry. That's why it is. That's what it is. Um, on the inside, you've got just that. There's no pockets or anything. Just the, the actual space itself on the inside. And this is magnetic. But it does feel really, uh, really nice. Um, and it's be great for um, an evening. 
Yeah. So that's that. And then finally, finally, this bag. Um, snake print again. But the reason why I like this is this is the back of it. This is eight pounds, by the way. First of all, because I normally go for bigger handbags, so I decided to go for something small. And then on top of that, I like the fact that look at the snake print here at the back. And then when you turn it to the side, look, you've got a, a kind of cream shade. And then, of course, you've got a cream on top. And then you've also got the little bit of the dark part here. And then like a grayish tone to it here. So it's got different tones. So and I thought, well, okay, well, snake print, but at least that will be interesting. What I also like is that you've got the actual zip detail. And the way it opens as well is, it is with a zip across, uh, which is nice. And on the inside, it's got the usual one pocket with the zip. And then... Um, two parts as well in there for you to slot whatever you want to slot in but it's nice and manageable so not every handbag needs to be massive i'm hoping i don't show you all my boobs and i'm here <laughs> sorry these tanned boots they are 16 pounds mine are in a size five and uh, that's us size seven i believe and i like these because the bill the the heel is quite chunky and comfortable and on top of thing else quality wise actually I'm quite surprised it's super comfortable to wear but more importantly they don't actually kind of fold which is normally why I don't tend to buy a lot of normal shoes from Primark because I find that when you can bend them about they're too thin and when you step onto anything any bit of stone anything you will feel it underneath your feet uh, for me quality is just not quite there trainers I'm all right flat shoes I'm, all, I'm sort of okay with depending on which one but heels um, I'm very particular especially nowadays otherwise I'll just be in tears within 10 minutes so these are really really good and of course you've got the uh, part in here which means that in the winter time when it's a little bit slippery and you uh, insist on wearing heels you can give these a go because you have a bit more grip underneath here well that's the excuse I'll be using anyway um, now that's enough of the accessories and so on for the clothes Starting off with this jumper, uh, it is so soft. I've forgotten what the name of uh, the design is called. I had it and it's just a slip of mind, but you know what I'm talking about. Um, but it is so soft and so nice and really, really thick. Um, and I just, oh man, it, it, it's so, so nice. Really, really good quality. And at the price as well, I think it was at 13 pounds, was it? Yeah, 13 pounds, I'm not gonna complain. They've got loads of different colors, but I went for this particular one here. Um, and yeah, it just, I, I really, really, really like the jumper. What can I say? You don't need to go and spend a fortune when it comes to jumpers. Um, you know, you can just pop over to Primark, save yourself a fortune and you've got a whole ton of uh, jumpers, jumper dresses and so on. So, so nice. And it feels really nice and comfortable. Um, and of course I paired it with, um, these ones, these are tr uh, smart trousers. Um, they're a bit high waisted for me, but then again, I'm a super short person. So chances are the standard waist is going to end up being a bit too high for me. For anyone who wants to know, five foot four and a half. Um, so that's that one. I mean, these are really, of course, at the time, um, color as well, or should I say camel. Um, and they're really, really nice and comfortable. And the price for these babies, um, uh, I think they were 14 or 15 pounds. Uh, I can't remember. Um, I can't find the receipt. Uh, I've lost my receipt. So. <laughs> Sorry. But you can find these ones. If you go to the um, where they've got the smart kind of like office wear type, they've got these. And I think they're really, really nice and comfortable as well. I've got these in a size six. And also the jumper was in a size small. Next lot, uh, another jumper, uh, another camel shade jumper as well. It's this one, um, which is obviously a high neck jumper. Um, I like this. Again, it feels really soft. Not as soft as the other one. I think it was it cable neck. That's it. That's the, what we're talking about, cable neck. But not as, uh, as soft as the other one, but still soft enough and very, very smart looking. I like this. Um, I've got it, I think, in a size small as well. Um, yeah, size small, which is a size uh, 10 to 12. I don't mind that when it comes to uh, jumpers and stuff because they're still a little bit loose for me I'm more of a size 8 size 6 size 8 um, But jumper wise I don't mind because I tend to tuck them in and I kind of leave them loose at the at the back and comfortable So I don't mind having it a little bit roomy uh, But he said yeah 10 to 12 is uh, is for a small if you're interested um, And what I like about that is that it's not so boring and simple 
it's also got the button detail here hopefully my camera will be able to uh, kind of there you go um yeah so it's got the, the buttons here that make which make it more interesting um next item that went with the jumper is uh, these pleated skirts so i've got two of them um that's this one here and they are kind of long and comfortable and i've actually seen exactly the same type uh, as zara what i like about the material is that it's actually really thick material i'm really surprised quality wise primark <laughs> hello i mean honestly really really good quality nice and thick um and also you can kind of it's comfortable around the waist i wouldn't call it high waisted but then again for me everything is high waisted but it's great if you tuck in a shirt or something like that sort or a jumper as uh, as you've seen um but i really really like the color um but yeah i thought it's really really nice and the price 15 pounds people 15 pounds this midi uh dress with a drawstring here shirt dress so we've got the strings here to tighten it around the waist um the material uh, feels kind of i don't know uh, thin ish but you know it's not bad quality wise it's got a little bit of a sheen to it um but it's nice and long and comfortable it's a shirt dress what can i say i do love my shirt dresses i am an inverted triangle body type so the uh, and also being a bit more heavy around the chest area having something with a, a kind of like a drawstring that i can pull i can pull and the shirt dress is actually something that suits my body type so i'm really comfortable with that and i do like them a lot so i will tend to always whenever i see a, a you know shirt dress i'm i kind of I have to I have to talk myself out of not buying one. So it is nice. Um that what is the price for this one? Um 18 pound. Next items that these ones and these are well basically roll neck, pearl neck, whichever one you want to call it. Um I've got it in a size small again. Um and uh, I really like this colour actually, it's got an unusual colour. Um and the cost is a uh, five pounds for this. Uh, nice and simple these are great for putting it and it actually feels really soft as well by the way uh, really really soft um these are great um, uh, for putting underneath uh, uh jumpers uh, you know anything so i like the color and it's a very very autumn kind of shade um and what i then did was i paired it with this skirt um and very similar to the other pleated skirt that i had oh my god I've got hangers everywhere and another pleated skirt this one is a size eight as well again price is 15 pounds it's got the belt that comes with it matching belt um and again i really like the fit of these really really nice uh nothing to complain about really really pretty um yeah what can i say now this shirt i mean it is see-through you'll probably if you want to wear it during the day wouldn't put a camisole or something underneath uh, underneath uh, if you're not feeling comfortable just wearing a bra i'm not really bothered unless i'm going to work i i'll be fine wearing it just so as it is but it is see-through i do like it it is very different from the normal me um but it's got kind of like a the ruched detail at the front i'm really terrible at describing things but you can see what i mean um but it's really really pretty i like the unusual um coloring and the fact that it was really kind of like in your face but it's also pretty but really um yeah if you keep everything else really simple and let the shirt do all the talking you'll be fine now price wise actually it's quite dear for primark 14 pounds for this um and it's got kind of the ruffle detail as well i was trying to think of ruffle detail at the front and it's also got that on the sleeves as well um and it fits really nice and it's tucked into a pair of jeans here is this as well this uh, lace detail uh, um, top uh, again it's got kind of like a puff sleeve or pleated sleeve type look uh, which is just at the top and not too many uh, too, um, not too too busy now again because I'm a bit an inverted triangle that means that my shoulders tend to be quite wide and more prominent um, and I have to be very careful with the kind of um, 
puff sleeves and uh, massive sleeves, uh, uh, you know, in the shirts and stuff like that because otherwise they can make things look really bad. But this is not bad at all. It was just at the top end. It is, it is a snug, snug fit. You do need to get the right size. And if you are really kind of gifted in the chest area, you might have to think about sizing upwards because uh, it doesn't give too much room for maneuver as well. I'm lucky that I managed to get it to fit as well. Uh, this one is in a size eight and it fit the chest area just about without making it look too tight and uncomfortable. Um, and the price for this baby is £12, which is uh, not bad. And last but not least, I got a poncho. Actually, I got two. I've got another one, which is a uh, Thompson black and white, but I, I've misplaced it somewhere. Plus, I'll be giving it back anyway. I'll be, I'll be returning that one, so I've not kept it. Now, obviously, uh, this is the, uh, um, the camel uh colored one um now these ones are one size by the way i wish they actually did had different sizes because um because i'm so short as well this does feel a bit uh, much i mean it's oversized if i wear it i have to make sure that i actually put it over my shoulders otherwise down it just looks as if i'm sort of drowning a little bit so um yeah it, it, be mindful how you wear it that's my advice um otherwise it just look as if it, you're all, uh, wearing something that's too too oversized Price is £12, which is actually a really good price. Again, it's really soft, but it, because it's so big as well, you can really wrap yourself up around it. Put a little brooch, or um, is it brooch or is it brooch? A little brooch uh, to keep it in place, um, and then you are really good to go. So, I nearly forgot. Homeware stuff. Oh my God. This, this, these, these, this candle. This one is at £6 which is a bit dear for candles, especially at Primark. But honestly, they smell so gorgeous. This is um, dark tuberose and uh, peppered pods. Um, and it comes in uh, this container. You can actually get them in a simple one in a little glass container, but I was feeling a little bit <clears throat> close. Uh, so I, <laughs> I got this and it smells, oh, it smells gorgeous smells so gorgeous and honestly you just i just want to go and then i can i can it just permeates the air it's just gorgeous i absolutely love it and of course uh just to prove that point as well i got the set this would be fantastic for a gift to someone honestly um hint hint um you've got here uh in a glass container i like the design on the glass container as well so you've got the standard candle in there and then you've got the reed diffuser as well to go with that so the two together is seven pounds which is really really super super affordable and cheap um and i really like the scent the scent is just beautiful absolutely gorgeous um yeah finally that's it. Those are all the items that I bought. Let me know which ones you like. And unfortunately, I do apologize for the lighting um, and my phone is ringing. Uh, it's time for me to go. And uh, <clears throat> people, I shall love and leave you all. Stay safe. Stay happy.